Hello everyone and welcome back to Crossplay ZW Chronicles X. Today, well, we're going to be taking two more quests from this Rothian stronghold. Hello, Go, how's it going? Hmm, I've seen you before. You carry yourself with the air of a master. Ah, I remember. I might your name be Hero, the human who bested Prince Jarg. Ah, uh, yeah. I knew it. Though my body may have age, my eyes remain keen. This is perfect. I am sure I can finally know peace if I entrust my dream to you. I am called Gold Bleg. Though I am now retired, I was a fighter of some repute back on our homeworld. I know my. I now spend my days training the next generation. Ours is a warrior race. Though we may face poverty or hunger, that pride and culture must never be allowed to perish. Will you show me your strength, fellow warrior? My ancestral armaments and a most modest sum awaits you when you complete this task. What do you say? I like the armaments. Overlord's eye patch. Okay. My thanks. First, I would beg a simple demonstration of your skill. An indigent hunt. Your target is a creature called the Welkin Levitha. Levitha? I think there's big whale things in the sky. I wish for you to slay two of them. I hear they make primordia their home. I will wait here for your word of your victory. I think there's like a few right outside of this door, but we're not in Primor yet. Anyways, the next quest was Zoe over here. What's up, Zoe? You are a blade, then. My name is Zoe Zenoth, and I hope you might accept the request. As you well know, the recent history of my people is marked by a shameful period of subjugation by the Galien. We have since found our way to autonomy, true, but the taint of that experience yet weighs heavy on my heart. Ever since claiming independence, I have sought the chance to vent my anger and venge the honor of my people. I believe that time is now. I have come to, into possession a piece of information capable of dealing a crippling blow to the Galien. Uh... Yo, what is it? May I ask your interest as an agreement to assist me in this matter? Yeah, sure, probably. Excellent. This is further proof that humans are a noble race, and that a strong sense of pride and honor connects our people. A gangling stronghold they called Bad Stronghold stands in the northwest of Savelm. I just like the name Bad. I know it's probably not pronounced it, but it's probably like Badar. Uh, I have learned that they are currently working uh, de uh, to develop a new weapon there. Now, if you can steal the plans for that weapon, it would deal a significant blow to their war efforts. I would entrust this mission to you. Uh, this may be a Rothian's request, but rest assured that if the gangling succeed in building this weapon, New LA shall suffer as well. My proposal will benefit both of our people. Benefit, not benefit. And we get a blueprint. Sweet deal. Um, of course, we're going to accept it. Let's do this one first because it's in Oblivia. I hope this joint effort against our common foe will serve to further strengthen the bond of our people Our people share. I thought it had another quest for us for a second. I'm going to say, what? Now, I was told there might be two quests on the white, right side and... Maybe one unlocks in the future. I don't know, but let's go over to the bad stronghold. Yep, gotta be honest, not exactly sure why I thought the bad stronghold was in Oblivia. I think I read the client location. I was like, oh, yeah, okay, we're in Oblivia. Good. No, no, we're we're in uh, Savellum, the nice fungus continent. Where is this thing I have to get? Is it a red bauble? Uh, is it something I have to loot? It looks like it's something I have to loot. Now... Where, though? Up here, though? Sure, let's land, and then... Okay, everyone actually up here, though. Thank you. Where's my other... Where's my party? Party form up. Okay, you all there? Great. Let's land, and then infiltrate like the ninjas we are. So there's two treasures in here. That's a level 49. We might not actually... Never mind. I was going to say, we might not actually have to fight anyone. Which, that's fine. I'd rather kill this guy quickly, though, if I have the chance. Because these guys, they can hurt me fairly easily. And then they stagger me, but then I kill them. So there's two treasures here. Can you see that for a second? Level 50 E-Rifle. Huh. All right, I'll take all. Okay, we already looted that one. That was the new weapon blueprint. All right, so back to the Rothian stronghold. Quick, let's turn this in before it turns into morning and he disappears. 
Yo, Zoe, I got the blueprints for you. We get a cutscene for this? That's neat. God, we're such badasses. I've been waiting for you, Blade. Forgive my impatience, but what of the operation? There you go. Please don't use it against us in the future. So these are the schematics for the Ganglion's new weapon. Excellent. I will require further analysis to be certain of its specifications, but it appears to be the new form of artil artillery with considerable range. Should they be allowed to complete it, New LA will no doubt find itself in the crosshairs. We must move quickly. I shall inform the New LA authorities at once. As someone who has been seen in their, their fortress, I would graciously seen the inside of their fortress. I would greatly appreciate your insight in this matter. Will you attend the joint planning meeting? Oh God, I'm very bad at planning meetings. Report, sir. An armed force believed to be from the Ganglion uh, is presently marching on our location. The Ganglion? They are after the plans. No, they would know it's too late to retrieve them. They then they either aim to take revenge for the theft or kill all who have seen them. In any case, it just further proves how important the plans are to them. All the more reason to beat back their advance. We will defend the, the information you are efforts of one of us, no matter the cost. I am sorry to have dragged you into the battlefield, but I would greatly welcome your help. His Highness is unfortunately away fighting the Gangly in a field. The Gangly in a field? I, know, I, don't, I feel. I don't think I've ever heard that phrase before, you see. And where guard Georg goes, God Buhid follows. With both of them gone, our strength is considerably diminished. Granted, it may well be too late for you to leave without fighting anyways. Har! You will find a man, a, na a man named G. Nogan outside. I ask you follow his instructions. May victory be yours. Sure. This is going to be a wave battle thing? I can do wave battle things. Also, if I come over here... Okay, he's not here. I was going to say, if he's sitting here, like, just twiddling his goddamn thumbs, then we're going to have words. We just need to go right outside. I mean, can I just jump? Oh, no. No, I can't. <laughs> My skulls are all the way down here. Oh, that's right. I remember. Because we had a fight to get inside that place back in the day. And... Hello, guys. And, uh, we lost, and I came back with my skulls, who were all the way down here. So where are these enemies? I don't think the enemies are actually down here. Oh, we're going to, uh, to meet that NPC dude, who just popped in. All right. Yo, G, what up? Ha, <laughs> get it. Ah, might you be the blade that Zoe has and en joined to wade battle at our side. I'm G. Nogan. I have been charged with leading the defense of this territory. The enemy has broken into several small groups in an apparent attempt in at infiltration. In order to penetrate this position, our foes will need to break through the tight passage ahead. <laughs> Hence, if we stop them at this passage, we will succeed in protecting this territory. I beg of you, let no foe through. Uh, tell G that you are ready for battle. No, begin. Well, should I should have waited? I fear the enemy has greatly outnumbered us, greatly outnumbered. But by using the terrain advantage out of the passage, it should be possible to handle them. I must join with Zoe now. Valor guide your blade. Oh, it will. Mostly Nagi's blade, because he's like a samurai slash god. Oh, hi everyone. I just gained 50, uh... 50 reward tickets based off you guys maybe I don't know I do like the fact that your friends aren't actually attacking us which is nice Let's shoot him with our mega blaster there we go oh no yeah I was building freaking TP off of him so these guys aren't too too bad I should have totally I was expecting to get in ground combat Put on my, one of my like ground combat traits. And yeah, now we just go into overdrive and start killing everyone. Because I like doing that. Still not really sure if I want to keep the uh, Delta Bliss on. But, you know, it's on. So, I'm not going to worry about it. 
Uh, yeah, I have some skills set up for like ground combat and you know, obviously some for skulls. For the most part, I just have Synchrony, I think that's what it's called, uh, as the skill equipped for the skull combat. Uh, there's some overdrive ones that I really don't care for. It's like you enter, apparently I got a blade medal, okay. Um, oh, did I clear? No, I didn't clear this, but I'm probably going to clear this. And get the, uh, the task reward for it. But yeah, I kind of always have my, uh, not always, but I have my ground combat skills on most of the time. Um, I just kind of swap one out for the synchrony skill, because it's really good when you're in a skull 90% of the time. Um, I'm going to overdrive again. Might as well. I mean, there's literally no reason not to do it. Well... I mean, I'm sure there's a reason somewhere not to do it. I can't really think of one, though. We got 49 seconds left. I'm not sure if any of the enemies have just decided to go through because I haven't been paying attention. I wouldn't be surprised, to be quite honest. Like, seriously, they could have just walked right by us as we were killing their friends, and none I would have been none the wiser. That's another one down. And we just cleared that, uh, that mission. I guess I could take my time and just be like, yo, let's wait for this timer to cool down and then not worry about it. I'm kind of hoping, though, there's not another wave after this. Yelv is down. And while there's, like, no chance of Nagi, Alexa, and myself dying, I shouldn't really say that before, you know, there's a chance of us dying. But, actually, how did Yelv even die? Yelv is a pretty strong dude, isn't he? I mean, he's not tanky. By any means, but he has about the same amount of health as me. Pretty sure he has as much equipment on, too. Mayday, mayday. The enemy has concentrated its forces for an attack on this position. We require reinforcements. We halted most of the main force here, but numerous units have slipped through and must be intercepted. Withdraw from your position and come at once. Time is of the essence, for even a moment's hesitation will result in more foes breaking through. Depart immediately. I repeat, depart immediately. You guys want to go do that other quest we have? You know, fine, let's go save the Rothians. Though, like, I thought this was, like, the main passage point. I guess behind would also count. Oh, do we have to go in? Do we have to go in? No. Really? No. No, we don't. No, we just need to kill these guys. Um, beam cannon? No, we only got, like... Oh, no, they all aggro. <laughs> all right, fine. How did you live? I'm actually surprised by that. Well, might as well do the second half in our skulls since we're already here. Then again, we weren't really having any trouble with these guys anyways. This is a four? What? Wait, no, 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 okay. I'm assuming it's just like four minutes until we fail. Is that it? Yeah, okay. I was gonna say, that's a little, a little much if we had to hold off those guys for freaking four minutes. It actually would have been, like, nonsense. There was no reason for that. It was just a time limit for us to fail, though. Let's go talk to Zoe. Have I already told you guys how much I miss the ability to change time on the fly <laughs> from Xenoplake? Oh, used to be such a good ability. I'm glad to see you both survived. Oh, we both survived. Uh, you have done much for us. I cannot adequately express my thanks. Were it not for your skill, this place might be under gangling control right now. I fear we are we're lax and bracing for a gangling attack. We let the distance from here to Savellum make us complacent. With In that respect, your stealing those plans has taught us even more than we expected. An in-depth analysis of the schematic should allow us to learn even more of the gangling technology and strategy. But I swear now to destroy them once that information has been extracted. We had no intention of deigning to use gangly weapons for from the outset, of course. But you have done much for us, and I do not want you to be plagued by needless worry. Again, allow me to thank you for your assistance. In return, I reaffirm that Rothian promised to offer humankind an unstinting aid in the struggle to defeat the ganglion. Farewell, brave, brave one. We got a plan for it. That's neat. Any other quests over here? 
Uh, maybe. Uh, let's go check out the two warriors. Alright, so these are the guys. I actually think... I wish I had known these guys were here. I flew, like, all around this place looking for these guys. And I clearly didn't see them. That is unfortunate. Let's just shoot this guy with our giant laser. And we just need to kill two of them. And don't, doing almost a million damage is a good way to kill them. You're not wrong. And there was some other here. Over here. I saw you a second ago. Where did you go? No, 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 no. Hey. Game. There they are. I was going to say, that's not cool, game. You can't just take them from me. I mean, you could just take them from me, but that wouldn't be cool. All right, so now we got to go talk to Go again. Uh, yeah, I'll take all whatever. While it's nighttime. Thankfully, I said it so that it was pretty much nighttime at its earliest when I came back to this mission, or turned in the last mission. Now, this guy made it sound like we were going to have another part of this quest, so I'm assuming we're going to get that part right now. The two Welkin uh, Levitas are defeated? Very good. Those beasts resemble the ones Rothians hunted when coming of age on our home planet. They seem fine opponents to gauge your skills as a warrior. Uh, claim that it was hardly a challenge. Complain that Rothian Coastal was brutal. Boast. <laughs> You're damn right, everyone. I see you have a medal to match your skill. I like it. I would welcome one of your caliber as my third pupil. But now is the time for the true test. I would have you challenge my pupils. Two Rothian males by the name of G. Zordo and Z G. Zordi. Okay. They're both skilled warriors and are all the more formidable when fighting as a pair. Uh, but of late, that power has made them proud. They have parted ways to train alone, no longer seeing the need for one other's aid. One another's aid. At this rate, I fear they will lose sight of their true potential and end up end life as mediocre talent. Therefore, I would ask you assistance in beating the, the sense back into them. G. Zodo is at King Falls in Oblivia. G. Dori, uh, Zordi is in Savelm at the Second Anvil Rock. I'll leave the matter to you. Go find. Uh, you can find me here. Sweet deal. Let's go beat the crap out of his pupils. Let's start with Oblivia. And he's right like next to us at FN Site 311. Not that far away from here. I, he could have done that himself. Where is this guy who I have to beat senseless? He's over here. Next, next to Daya? Daya? Deus Ex Machina? There you are. Are we going to fight on this little cliff side? Because that, that seems dangerous. Are you doing Tai Chi? I like your fur. And your chest spikes, which seem very inconvenient to me. You must be the one my master sent. Well met. I have waited for you far too long. Uh, hail boldly. Respond in equally grand fashion. Respond to Jesus' impressive greeting with a calm and steady tone. What? Speak up, human! Be heard! You sound like the mewling, weakling Jesus O.D. And yet you have earned the faith of my master. And so I have no doubt that your demeanor must mask a set of well-honed fangs. Ah, my pulse pounds in anticipation. Come, hurry, let the match begin. I am G. Zordo, hero among Rothians, courageous and bold, fierce and fearless. I argued the proper method of war long and loud with G. Zordi. With this battle, I will prove that mine is the only truth. Stand you, uh, stand you ready? Yeah, sure, why not? Then let our duel begin. You, you pretty neat. I'm gonna beat you up though. No offense. You are, you are, you are level 40. Don't worry though, I, I won't, I won't use overdrive on you. No, I'll save that for your partner. We're gonna be able to fight both of them, right? This wasn't just like a choose one and then we're done? Haha, <laughs> you have more than proven your strength. You have an impressive blend of fearsome power and beautiful technique. Oh, thank you. I see now why my master Go sent you. I lack your refined skill. I merely fix the enemy in my sights and charge forth. Until now, G. Zordi was always at my back to help direct that force. Fighting you has forced me to acknowledge just what a boon that was. Agree. Hmm, perhaps you are right. I could spend a lifetime passing on alone, uh, pressing on alone, and never reach my, your level. 
Oz was no minor qual either. And while I am unsure how to approach him now, I'll begin by asking my master where to find him. You must go and fight G's O D as well, for he is my nemesis and greatest ally. I eagerly, will eagerly await the day we cross blades again. For now, farewell. Goodbye. So let's go to Salvellum in the Anvil Rock 2, Electric Boogaloo. Are you up here? You are up here. What the hell? Ooh, what the hell? When have you got here? That makes no sense, Kronos. That doesn't make any goddamn sense what you just said. When you got here. Wait, did someone said something about a flying ship in Savellum? Is this it? I saw these things in Cauldros, and they beat the living but Jesus out of me. So yeah, let's go fight it. I don't that's one second. One second. It won't improve greatly, but I might as well put it on. You know, it's twelve percent. Twelve percent is twelve percent. Okay. Um You're like spitting oh, you're level ninety? Can I target you? I can. Alright. Here we go. Uh concentrate, thank you. Let's see. Oh we got it. Cool beans, we broke its thing. Oh, that seems bad. That's a decent amount of damage. If I can get into cockpit mode, that'd be great. There's a level 59 named dude down there. Um, I should probably be careful of him. Oh, Nagi's down. I gotta keep an eye on my health. Because I will use a frame for this. You know what? I will use a frame for freaking... Uh, the White Reaper, if I need to. So keep an eye on that health. And then fire your goddamn hand Gatling guns. We're all attacking the same thing, right? And by all, I mean the, the two of us. Because that's all that's left, baby. Okay. Sure. That was unfortunate. Can I go to cockpit mode now? I wish to, uh... I wish to shoot this thing with giant lasers again. Can I shoot your leg? Yeah, I can. Okay, again. Keep an eye out. Fuck off. That was not good. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Get up, get up. Xenogears, get up. Good, good shit. Good shit right there, son. Um. Yeah, let's use all of our frame patches. That scared me. You're not wrong. Shoot the leg with your hand, Gatling Guns. Thank you. Wow, we are getting... Fucked. Well, it was a worthy attempt. I'm gonna die before I hit the ground. Nope, I lived. I can't even reach it from here. Look, I broke a lot of its parts. I got it down enough. Maybe if I get a... Ow. Maybe I get a little bit more equipment. Or another Ares 90. I can, um... Actually take it on. I'm gonna get my skulls back, though. Alright, we're back from tempting fate. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. And see what he has to offer. I'm guessing you guys are brothers. Um... We're out of our skulls now. Whoever that was. Maybe Nagi? I hear G. Zodu lost to you. I was He was a fool not to heed my warnings. I told him his brute force approach would one day leave him open to a blade of more a more thoughtful opponent. And what was your impression? Did G. Zodu put up a fight fit to uphold the pride of the Rothians? Say that you felt overpowered by his large frame and blade? Say it was an easy battle. It was an easy battle. Agreed, a strong fool is still a fool just the same. He does not understand how power should be used. Forgive the long preamble, I am G Zodi. My master appears to consider G Zodu and myself to be equals, but I am nothing like that muscle head brute. He's a mindless uh, he, he is a mindless violence, uh, wa whereas I practice war as a, the, a true art it is. Okay. 
To receive the battlefield with a cool head before cutting through with a swift blade is the warrior's way. I'll prove that with my actions now. Ungod. Alright, so I'm gonna beat the living hell out of you like I beat your brother up. I can't overwatch you though because I kind of, well, fought that giant thing in the sky. Did you notice that? Like, it's right above you, man. How could you not notice that? It's scary. And it hurt me. I actually put up a pretty decent fight, I think. I got it down fairly decently. Have I had... I don't know. More skulls? <laughs> more level 60 skulls? I probably could have done it. Uh, you remain level-headed throughout, yet at times made moves that could only be called reckless. It is as if fire and water inhabited a single body. I was wholly unable to read your attacks. No, the truth is that my own in intentions were not too easy to read. This is what my master tried to tell me. I was always able to catch my opponents unawares because Jizodu, Zido, whatever, was there to throw them off guard. The same mindless violence I insulted was the very piece missing from my own fighting. Uh, agree. Thank you, Nagi. True, it may be something I would never find without his aid. But I said many harsh things in our argument and do not know the words to offer him now. First, I must return to my master, Gobleg, and thank him for sending you to me. I wonder what Ji Zodu gained from the fighting from fighting you, for he is my greatest rival and strongest ally. Tell me, what did he say when no, forgive me, I must ask ask him that myself. For now I beg your leave. Farewell. Goodbye. It's still nighttime, we have a chance to make it. Run faster, hero, we only have an hour. Hey girl, what's up, buddy? You return at last. Good. I grew wary of waiting. And, where are, my, where are my pupils able to land a blow? I mean, not really. They hit us. But I beat the crap out of them. So, were there, were, so they were a mere warm-up for you. All the more reason I was right to scout you. For even your proud tongue serves as proof to your strength and skill. But this is all good news. Losing to you seems to have shown them that the path to mastery is one they will have to walk together. Both returned to me separately to take stock of themselves, and I sent them into the Outfitter's Test Hangar in New Alang's Administrator's District. The moment they see each other there, I expect they'll be as if no time has passed at all. Which brings me to my final request. I would ask that you spar with my pupils once more, but this time as a pair. It would be their first fight together in some times. Go and test the measure of your bond. That should be well within your ability. Okay, sure. Oh, you know, this actually makes sense, because there was a, like, a quest marker type thing here on my map that I think I even mentioned earlier. I'm like, I don't know where this NPC is. He's just not here. And that was just an ending point for this quest. I like it. Alright, so I got to talk to both of them or one of them? Uh, I don't care which one I talk to. Who has the bigger spikes on their chest? That is, like, not safe to be folding your arms like that. I have forgotten the plain spoken charms of Jizodo. There's a reason I chose to walk the warrior's path with him when we were first young cubs. To think I nearly threw that all away over a single difference of opinion. I was a laughable fool. You are at our heart uh, you are here at our master's behest, are correct? Come to fight us. I feel ready to defeat any challenger today, and you? Is your blade keen and your mind sharp? Uh always? Kind of? G Jizodo, are you ready? Ready and long tired of waiting, my brother. If you watch my back, I will be free to use my strength to its fullest. Understood. I know my role as well. Then let us show our friend the true measure of our combined strength. Ah, uh, time to put some kitties down. You guys gained levels. That's cheating. I mean, I don't think it's going to be a big problem, really. Um, unless your buddy can heal you now. If your buddy heals you now, that's gonna kinda be annoying. To be fair though, not that annoying. Yo, who knocked him down? I'm gonna take you out for drinks after this, because that was beautiful. Do I not? Oh, I didn't put my goddamn Fortify Flesh Mark on. Ah, well. Keep shooting. We're gonna go to overdrive on this guy's ass. Okay, hit him. Thank you. Overdrive! Yeah. Actually, didn't do that much damage in comparison. Are we... Are you hurting me? Did you get buffed or something? You 
seem buffed or something. Oh, you have some sort of... You did have some sort of buff on. I don't know what it was. We lost again, my brother. It seems we have much more growing left to do. Yet I feel no regret, for even in defeat we have gained much. We And we will continue to grow as long as we stay together. Bah, I would have... Uh, I would have it no other way. One day soon, all of Mera will be chanting our names. Since when did your ambition run so small? Aim for the galaxy at the very best, or very least. Ha 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 ha! Well said. As I recall, that was our dream as young cubs. Thank you, hero. You have helped us re recover so much, including some long-lost ambitions. <laughs> My pulse dances in anticipation. Come, Zidori. Or whatever. Let us begin our training immediately. Yes. We have, uh, we have no time to waste. It will be not be long until we have strength to rival even yours, hero. I hope you will favor us another match then. Until that day, be well. Alright. Cool. That was neat. Alright, so... Actually, why isn't this... This quest... Oh, I gotta go back and turn it in. I'm like, wait a minute. This quest marker thing didn't turn... Like, change. Yo, go. I beat the crap out of your students again. You have returned, and from the looks of it, it was a fierce battle. Yeah, yeah, I guess. What do you think? Were my pupils able to hold trust in one another and draw forth a power greater than their own? Well, yeah, it was two. Say so they were, like, entirely different fighters. They also gained, like, eight levels. If a warrior of your skills say so, I have no doubt. Huh. <laughs> this time my pupils departed on a journey to train together. I doubt they will lose their way again. Competition between them will horn their edges into fine blades. I thank you for using your strength to guide them. This is an old teacher's humble thanks. It would please me for you to have it. I got an eye patch. Go me. ID final survey. Oh, in, uh, industrial district. Is I 100% the industrial district? No. Oh, it's at 81%. What the fuck are you talking about? Anyways, we're going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, on the end of my video section, check out some of my other content and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great day.